can show you what love's supposed to feel like I can show you what love's supposed to be Welcome back to my channel today. I'm here with Yurela here once more. This is their packaging It has all their social media on the front of the box as I open the box I see this drawstring bag Number one tip use this as storage for when you want a story wig. Okay, I keep on telling you guys this don't throw it away You can use it for other stuff too. It's totally up to you. I got this bag filled with little goodies, you know wig cap edge brush and comb um, lashes the whole works then I got this bandu or headband if you want to call it that blinged out and then finally the wig this is a gorgeous 16 inch highlighted um, light brown wig it's a curly texture it's a 13 by 4 and it is so soft so soft you guys know I love getting these colored wigs um, so this is how the inside of that looks it has a total of three combs on the inside of the cap and adjustable straps in the back of course you know that little lace there in the back you just cut that away with your scissors you don't want to leave that on the wind blows your neck back they're gonna be seeing lace around there no that not look good you have to cut that off so yeah and it also is pre-plucked a bit you could definitely go in more though and pluck it if you want um so it's totally up to you i then proceed to applying this on my head and as you can see, yes, I know it looks pretty short, but yeah, it's 16 inches and it's a curly texture. So of course, it's gonna be shrunken. I cut away some of the lace there before even applying adhesive because I, for, I recently got my eyebrows microbladed and I'm not supposed to really be touching them like that. <laughs> so I'm really just trying to, you know, work around the area in the best way that I can so that's all that is by the way if you want to see that go ahead and check out my vlog channel petite Sue tv to see the whole process of when i was getting my brows retouched check that out um i proceeded as you can see to applying my adhesive my got to be spray and this is the adhesive i use most of the time as you guys know it's quick it's convenient i've been using it for years um i try other things here and there but for some reason i keep on going back to god to be i don't know why <laughs> i'll use glue whenever i want a longer install though but you know got to be does the trick it works so i really like like how the hairline looks there you see that it's nice it's not like overly plucked or anything but as i said if you want and sometimes i do prefer more graduation myself today i wasn't being too fussy though um I, for the most part i try to show you guys the hairline just that it, as it comes with the wigs um because i want to show you that you don't have to stress yourself out if you don't know how to pluck and all those stuff you can wear them right out of the package because the hair companies are doing pretty good on on how they're customizing their wigs okay so i i proceeded to applying that elastic band to further melt the lace and then i cut away the excessive lace and go over the little free edges that were lifted with just a tad bit off got to be to just lay it back down and make it appear you know more undetectable again so yeah i can show you what love's supposed to feel I can show you what love's supposed to be. I can show you what love's supposed to feel like. I can show you, yeah. I can show you, yeah. I then proceeded to using my flyaway tamer. I love these wax sticks because they really do help with the edge portion and just like just laying down the wig to not making it look lumpy and buffy i'm all done with installing the wig now so this is how we're looking um so it's really for me it was really easy to install because i knew that i didn't want to wet these curls they're really soft and nice minimal shedding i got minimal shedding like I run my hand through it and I definitely got hairs but it's not excessive I got like three strands and again as you know it's processed here so that's expected but it's really soft it's really full and I really love the way it just you know it was really easy to work with um, again it is 16 inches long and because you know it's curly it's shrunken so that's how it looks um, shout out to them for this gorgeous gorgeous wig 
once more because you know yeah if you like big looks i didn't wet it up on purpose because i wanted to give you guys this voluminous curly look i've been feeling that since lately <laughs> but yeah so yeah that's pretty much it for today's wig look go ahead and thumbs up this video if you liked it and if it was informative and the direct link to this wig and all the specs will be in my description box so go ahead and check that out and i'll see you guys in my next videos until then just go make up for myself I can show you what love's supposed to feel like